Ladies and gents, once again welcome to the World Championships of the British Lawnmower Racing. Do you race? And when you come, when you finish. But it has had 50 years since the port sport was started, and um, there are enough crazy people out there who want to jump on a mower, tweak it up, and go hurtling around the field during the summer months. And uh, long may it last. It doesn't drive like anything that you've ever driven before, so you've got to learn it from scratch. Take the burger. Don't touch me. Go. Get out. Don't come back. Get in the by tram. Huh? Take the burger. Don't touch me. No, we're not trying. It sort of surprised us because people love to be abused apparently. They like to be sworn at, they like to shout at waiters while waiters shout at them. For us, it's just release your inner demons mostly. The customer is always right at pretty much every other hospo venue. Here the customer is always wrong and there's nothing they can do to be right except maybe tip us like $500. I loved it. <laughs> <laughs> participar por lo que miraban que mi panza era grande entonces me dijeron de que, que, que iba جان در حال حاضر توی مسابقات همین داخل سطح تهران به عنوان افتخاری رانندگی میکنه ولی کسی نیست که تو این سن مثلا تو ایران کسی نیست دختر بچه تو این سن رانندگی بکنه ولی کسی نیست با تو مسابقه بده بچه بودم رو پای بابا میشستم و خیلی رانندگی رو دوست داشتم بیا ما به بابا گفتم بابا میشه به من رانندگی را بدیم با من بابا من به اعتماد کردم به بابا اعتماد کردم که اون روز من تونستم رانندگی را بگیرم I prayed that I would be able to do that face on face Peggy how are you Nice to see you. Yes. Oh. Thank you for all of that.
So it's an old dead jitterbug. Yeah, right. Yep, yep. Right? yep. This girl thinks I abandoned her, and, and that's the crux of, that's really the crux of why I'm here. She didn't want me to marry a Japanese girl. I think it was a combination of guilt and confusion and, and uh, sadness. This is truly the Peggy that my dad is looking for. Way to find out, I'll take my Bluetooth headphones over there and brought their little, your video clip and I played it and she, she right away, I remember him, he, he really loved me, you know. I was scared at first. I thought maybe my mother and Duane wouldn't talk like they did, but when they started smiling and talking, and it was all worth it. And I thought about that all my life, that I worried, worried that you thought that I abandoned you. And I'm here to tell you that I didn't abandon you at all. I just couldn't find you. I worked with all of that, and remembering, save all of that picture. Yes. You must have loved it. I did. You gave me that picture. He kept those in his wallet for 70 years. That's what he said. What's your middle name? Duane. D-U-A-N-E. Now I just came to light how I really got that name in. It wasn't by happenstance. It was for a reason, I believe. Did you feel abandoned? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. 